The topical issue at the moment is that of the disappearance and the recovery of Honorable JJ, who has been a, found to be kept somewhere. And we feel that it's not, they're not been very good for us to keep quiet when an issue of that nature is a current recovery in the whole country. Basically, all what we want to say is that the issue is not of uh, Honorable KJ because that issue is being currently pursued by the police. We do not want to be found in a queue of people that are making utterances, accusations, counter accusations on an issue which is professionally handled by the police. So we will not go that way ourselves at the party because we want the we want the, the police to do their work and finish it. But our concern is that of uh, the utterances that are coming in line with the unfortunate situation that happened where our member of parliament found himself in a very bad situation. The issue that's at the point of almost dividing the country by using hate speeches we have situations where people are making threats. The threats that are quite dangerous in the sense that uh, when you look at the events even around the region, it is those ways coming from uh, some of the people that have so far been uh, quoted by the media agitating the Zambians to rise. The people that are coming up with statements that are quite dangerous, instead of expressing themselves through the media, through the police, so that an investigation can be made, but they came out with conclusions, very wrong ones, very dividing statements we feel at the party that those statements were quite dangerous and we feel when we say one Zambia, one nation, what comes to our mind is the unity, peace and the tranquility to hold our country together, not in the manner that the so-called opposition leaders who are thriving to become leaders of this country coming out with dead, very, very dangerous statements. Those statements, as far as we are concerned, are unacceptable to us. Let us bring together this country together. You can see when those leaders came out with those dangerous statements, the reactions from the youth in the eastern province were now they were declaring war. That's how irresponsible some of those statements that were coming up from the opposition leaders. We are getting a feeling that some opposition leaders wants to create an atmosphere that can make Zambians rise. They want to come out with statements to provoke our government into moving in to arrest them. But we want to tell you that we are a civil government our president has been categorical 
that he needs peace. He needs us to work together. He recognizes the importance of constructive criticisms.